dearest gentle reader, we have been apart for far too long. At last, London's fashionable set has made its return. And it seems that our bon ton is moving with the changing tide. So, too, is this author. I cannot live at home any longer. I must take a husband. Does my lady have a suitor in mind? Is that her brother? Colin. Brother, under what foreign sun did you apparently get so sturdy? <laughs> oh, it is good to see you. Is it? Something wrong? Seems as though every Bridgerton was born to attract notice. For some of us, notice is very slight. It's a husband, is what you seek. Let me help you. Are we not friends? Friends. I should like to see your skills as they are first. How delightful to see you all. The splendid weather we are having. I would not be angry if I'm to be a lost cause. You must not say such things. You are Penelope Featherington. Do not forget that. She's not seeking a husband in you, I hope. No, I'm only helping her find one. Since when are you worried about Penelope? What this author knows to be true is that diamonds are not the only gems that sparkle. Lord Debling, he is eager to take a wife this season. You look especially beautiful tonight, Miss Featherington. You have done very well, Penelope. What more could you want? Mother, do you believe the best foundation for love is friendship? It is rare, but you must follow your heart. What is the primary force that guides us along our paths? Penelope. Is it our minds or our hearts? <laughs>